above entitled action determined that the penalty to be imposed upon Luis Enriquez Monroy Bracamontes for the murder of Sacramento County Sheriff's Deputy Daniel Oliver is death. A jury handing down the death penalty today to convicted and confessed cop killer Luis Bracamontes. The illegal immigrant from Mexico was found guilty last month for the murders of two Sacramento area deputies in October of 2014. And today, jurors spoke with us about their decision and the trial. CBS 13's Angela Greenwood was in the courtroom when the verdict came down. She joins us now in studio with more on this. Angela. Antonio Christina, some of those jurors walked out of the courtroom in tears today, not about their choice to sentence Luis Bracamontes to death, but for the family of these deputies and today's verdict bringing more closure on this long and painful road to justice. Tears of both sorrow and joy today from the loved ones of slain Sacramento County Sheriff's Deputy Danny Oliver and Placer County Sheriff's Detective Michael Davis Jr. as a jury sentenced their killer to death. To actually hear those words in the imposition, not just for one, but for both deaths, um, was, a, was a great relief. Wearing the same chilling grin he wore during his double murder trial, Luis Bracamontes laughed as he heard his life's new fate, looking right in the eye of Danny's mother, Jerry, and clapping. She smiled back, her focus unfazed. Justice is done for Danny and Mike. The jury was officially dismissed from the case today. We just want to make sure that we got it right. Break up soon. No, kill more. From the offensive outburst by Bracamontes. It was um, directed at us many times and um, worrisome in, in many ways. To months of heartbreaking evidence and testimony, juror Sam Wood says it's been emotional. When you're a juror on something like this, it pulls you into the experience that the families had. And that for me was very difficult and very emotional. Jurors say the outburst didn't and couldn't play a role in the jury's verdict. And while Vincent Shank says Bracamontes' own confessions made the guilt phase easier, today's verdict was a bit more heavy. You're dealing with someone's lives. It's not something to take lightly. For the brutal murders of two local deputies, still grieving loved ones say death is a well-deserved sentence. I can think of no more fitting candidate for it than him. And we do want to point out that today's verdict was reached after only four hours of deliberation. A judge is now scheduled to formally sentence Bracamontes on April 25th. Angela.